You know, I don't really have anything against religion per se. I don't really mind if people are religious. I'm not out to destroy religion or eradicate religion. The reason I make these videos is not so much because I oppose religion as it is that I oppose people who want to tell me that I'm stupid because I don't believe in religion. Like this guy. When you say that God doesn't exist, you abandon knowledge, morality, and truth. And that's just stupid. When you say that God doesn't exist, you abandon knowledge. And you say such ridiculous things like, I could be wrong about everything I think I know. I may not even exist. Are you kidding me? Skepticism, the understanding that there are no ideas that we shouldn't question, doubt, or critically investigate, is what has allowed civilization to claw its way out of the Dark Ages. Some of the biggest obstacles to scientific progress have been the times when certain ideas have been elevated to the status of unquestionable dogma. And we're stupid because we refuse to place these obstacles in front of ourselves? And if you remember, the number one most irritating logical fallacy is the straw man argument. And that appears to be this guy's favorite tactic. When you say that God doesn't exist, you abandon morality and say such absurd things like nothing is absolutely wrong in every situation. Not even rape, not murder, not even child abuse. Are you serious? I don't believe in objective morality, but I can't think of any circumstances under which I would find any of those things acceptable. And I don't know of any atheist who has ever said, well, under certain conditions, rape would be just fine with me. When you say that God doesn't exist, you abandon truth. You don't even claim to know truth. You suppress the truth in your unrighteousness. How do we suppress truth? We question ideas that you think are true, is that what you mean? What would you have us do? Stop asking questions that you don't like? Would you have us stop investigating the ideas that you consider sacred? That would be suppression. You abandon the truth so much, so bad, to such an extent, you come up with dumb ideas. It's more likely that we live in a computer. Who the fuck has ever said that it's more likely that we live in a computer? Who has ever fucking said that? I've been told that I argue from an intellectually dishonest position because I claim I know things. I suspect that you have been told that you argue from an intellectually dishonest position because there's really no point in engaging in an argument unless you are open to be convinced that your position is wrong. If you continue to hold your belief regardless of how airtight an argument against it may be, then the reason you hold that belief is not really because arguments support it. And when you try to defend your belief using argument, you put up the false pretense that your belief is based in sound reasoning when it is really based in faith. I am open to be convinced that there's a God. That is why I am willing to engage in debate about it. You are not open to be convinced that God does not exist. So when you make arguments for your positions, you are not really engaging in debate. What you're really doing is engaging in evangelism and trying to pass it off as debate. 